objective is clear for the New England Revolution. After a lackluster 1-0 loss to the Metro Stars last Saturday, two-goal margin of victory over the Metro Stars tonight puts the Revs into the Eastern Conference Championship game. The best season in Revolution history comes down to one game, and it's coming up next on WB56. New England Revolution Soccer is presented by the Massachusetts State Lottery. It's Eastern Conference semifinal game two from Gillette Stadium, the Revolution versus the Metro Stars. And just two hours ago, Brian Hall and his crew of officials walked the field in the heavy snow. It's lightened up a little bit, but they will stop the game to clear the lines if necessary. So glad you could join us for this big... Welcome back from Gillette Stadium. Snow or not, we're playing soccer. It's the deciding game two of this aggregate goal series between the Revs and the Metro Stars. Nice jack-o'-lanterns by Prairie of the Midnight Riders Supporters Club. Great work out in the parking lot before the game. The goalkeepers for this game, MLS All-Star Matt Reese for New England. The Metro Stars' Tony Miola put up his 10th career playoff shutout last Saturday versus the Revolution at Giants Stadium. Revolution trail by one goal. They need at least one if they hope to move on and they kick off wearing their home blues going from right to left, attacking the north fort end of the stadium. The Reds are getting closer and closer. But now Jorkayev is behind the defense. Parkhurst giving chase. Reese off his line. Jorkayev! That could be the dagger in the heart on the counter attack. Yuri Jorkayev makes it 2-0 on aggregate just moments after Clint Dempsey hit the goalpost at the other end. Oh, and it seems like it always goes that way. You get a good chance like this where Clint Dempsey's all alone. He has all kinds of space to go in goal. And then right on going the other way, and Michael Parker's just, it skips around. We talked about anticipating a little mistake, a little skip off the post. And Jorkaev, a player of that class, is not going to miss a chance like that. He's all alone, slides it into the side netting calmly and coolly, give the Metro Stars a 2-0 aggregate lead. The Metro Stars have certainly taken their time getting back from their goal celebration. $60, $270, or as low as $180 for season tickets. Knocked down by 12, and here's Cancela. He's in, he shoots! It's 2-0 aggregate! Jose Cancela! the roll of the dice that Steve Nickel was hoping for right there. Jose Cancela, skillful with the ball. Look how he brings it down in the box right here. Gets around four defenders and just buries it past Tony Miola. That's that little lift the Revolution needed. I really think that once they get the first one, they can get the second one. Now they have the first one. They can just keep pushing, keep pushing. They broke that, that barrier that the Metro Stars Metro had. Stars. Cancela over the head of Miola! The Revolution are back on level terms. They've come from 2-0 down. It's 2-2, Pat Noonan. What a great fight from the Revolution to get back into this. Steve Nichols not satisfied. You can see him, he's like, come on, we can get another one. You've got the momentum, you've got the energy. Pat Noonan just sitting on the back step right there. He rises above Michael Bradley to knock it into the net. Perfect header. Look at how Noonan just gets above Bradley to get the header. No foul, just a little touch into the box. Eddie Gavin can't touch him. 12 minutes barged again. Play on from the referee. Smith. Smith into the box. Smith takes the shot and scores. Are you kidding me? The Rams lead in the series. talked about it. We wanted Connell Smith to get out there on the space and start running at the defense. That's exactly what happened. Happened with a foul at midfield. Brian Hall does well to say play on because he sees the situation right happening. Nice little ball to Connell Smith. He just pushes Eddie Gavin out of the way and then he's got no problem putting it into the side netting. Look at this. Miola gets nothing. Left foot, side netting. Perfect goal. Look at Steve Nichol. He's loving it. Well, the Revolution made a preseason trip to Bermuda where they played against some pain. He deserves it, though. 
There will now be five minutes of stoppage time for the Revs to kill to move on to the playoffs. Yeah, we're well, looking at the clock that's running. I guess that actually means eight minutes of stoppage time. It's another five minutes, from what we understand, added on to what's happening now as soon as the ball gets back into play. Well, they will play the corner flag. 